They can use it as they see fit, okay? That's all I can do for you. Well, here's the deal. I know you're not gonna no, air it. I don't know that we're not gonna air it. I don't. I, know, I don't think. I don't. I'm not. I have no faith that you're gonna air it. But what okay, I do we're know we're is that good. we're going to document to our people that we told you. Okay. What the deal was. Again, man, I'm here. You're talking about New York, so you know. But I'm, I'm giving you this at least this opportunity to get get the word out. All right. Christine, yep, Christine, you have a roll call? Two, three. One, two, three. You good? All right. Can I get you to give me your first and last name and spell? My name is Brian Cole. B-R-I-O-N-C-O-L-E. All right, Brian. What's your message? Okay, this message is to anyone who is truly concerned about getting harmony in America. It's not an issue of whether or not there are good or bad police officers. What the issue here is that all police officers under the blue shield are forced to, uh, they're mandated to a code that treats different demographics differently. There's another issue with policing in America. The issue is that municipalities prey upon their citizens. All officers have quotas that they have to meet for victimless crimes, which put stress on the average citizen. The, the, the human toll of the rat race is tremendous, and the average person cannot afford it. It destroys the family. It, it creates the latchkey situation. It creates the wayward youth situation. It creates the child who doesn't get enough attention. What we need to do is we need to have legalistic policing right style throughout the nation, by the book, and oh. all interactions with any municipality, police officer, judge, right. should be audio and visually yeah, recorded I'm coming over and by law. And if America really wants any Thing that resembles harmony, what they will do is they will take that into consideration and, and let's move forward on that. Because what the deal is is that none of us will survive this if we don't sit down and let's start from scratch. We brag in America about how we have the longest running constitution, but it's faltered. It was developed by hypocrites. Thomas Jefferson owned his mistress and then denied her children. We need to restructure this in a melting pot fashion so that we can go forward and go to where man has never gone before. Thank you for your time. Okay. Period. Like I said, thank you. Yeah, I, I appreciate it. And I and I know you're not gonna air that. I don't know. This is what I but what this is what I do want you to do. What I want you to do 